Hey guys, what's up? In today's video, I'm going to talk about the Canon FD speed booster for the Canon EOS M. Um, firstly, this thing is absolutely fantastic. I paid 90 bucks for it, and honestly, I didn't think I was going to get the best quality. I was going to see some deterioration in quality, um, some blue flares wide open, as the website stated. Uh, but I've had absolutely no issues with this adapter. Um, this thing is absolutely one of the best investments that I've done for the Canon EOS M. Um, it's an all metal mount. Um, as the website states, it's four elements in two groups and it reduces the focal length by 0.71 times. Um, so if you're using a 50mm, it'll be about 57mm in terms of the field of view and it'll increase the stop of light by one. So if you're using an f1.8 lens, it's going to go down to about f1.2. Uh, so this thing is really, really fantastic. Um, I've tested some lenses out. I've got the Canon 28mm uh, f2.8, the 50mm f1.8 and the Canon FL 58mm f1.2 um, and using the speed booster uh, these are absolutely fantastic. Great depth of field, very good sharpness because you're using the whole glass, um, the whole image sensor and it's just absolutely fantastic. It's been a joy to use the speed booster. So take a look at the video that I've shot using the speed booster and these Canon FD glass. So what do you guys think? Personally, I'm really happy with the speed booster. Um, like I said, it only cost me 90 bucks and in comparison to the Viltrox, this thing feels exactly the same. Um, it's got these sort of um, distorted edges wide open, but as you stop down, it clears off and there's absolutely no issue uh, with this speed booster. Highly recommended if you collect Canon FD or FL lenses. Um, this thing is a must. So thanks guys for watching, hopefully you got something out of it and I will see you in the next video.